Hello, thank you for watching the Kempler Design Vlog. We're looking today at, I have to come up with a name because it has a lot of different names. The industry has had this type of a product now for quite a while, started in other places and then came into the United States and now it's a pretty common thing. With some companies it's called a dual shade, with some companies it's called a zebra shade, with some companies it's called a banded shade, and with some companies it's called bleep bleep bleep, and with others bleep bleep bleep. Okay, I, I like to be silly as you can tell. The point is that you can get this from a lot of different locations, but I want to go over the basic idea of why it's popular. One of the reasons is because I call it a hybrid shade because it has the ability of, as you can see, complete privacy right now. Now, the way that it works, and I'm going to try and make this easy. I'll take some pictures later and, and show it, but you can see my hand as it goes up. So sheer portion, light filtering portion, and this portion here can also be room darkening. So that would give you room darkening, room darkening with the shear in between. And then on the back layer, let me show you as it raises up. And this is done with a Sumphy motorized system. It's not a new system. Some of the newer ones uh, have different motor systems, a little quieter. I just want to show you the overall um, way that it works. So you can see that it has a band here that is going up towards the top. And the bands that is underneath right here, right here, that doesn't move at all because it comes down off the top, loops down, spins right here. And again, the bottom rail, there are a lot of different types available and it raises all the way up to the top like that. Another nice thing about this product is that unlike a Roman shade, which has a tendency with the traditional style to stack at the top, maybe to about here, this goes all the way up to the top and I will let it do that. And if you notice, the battery was just flashing red and that means it needs to be charged. That's a whole nother video. Again, to lower it, and here's a great feature of it. One thing about this, I hit on the some fee systems and with different motor systems, they have different ways of working, but here is a my button. And when you hit the my button, it goes to a place that you say, I want the shade to go to my position all the time. And it's gonna take here probably another 20 seconds, so if you wanna fast forward, you can. But as it's going down, it's going to stop just above the bottom, and we're gonna talk about that, it's really important. When it goes to the favorite position in this product, which is not for total privacy, for the, but it's for the best shear, because of the way that it loops, it actually creates that openness or that fake shear at the very bottom. Notice right now as it stops at that point. It's giving you shear to the outside, but in here, can, well, I don't know if you can see it, right in here at the bottom, there is a gap of about this much, which equals approximately what you have here. But if you have it shear, then the chances of it being open at the bottom isn't a problem for you. If it is, this isn't the right product. The dual zebra banded shade, I need to come up with a new name for it. Let's just call it the hybrid shade for today. Uh, that, if, it, if it's what it's doing right here is perfect for you, then it's a great product. If you want total um, either room darkening, if these bands again are room darkening fabric, just choose a darker material, but keep this in mind. The fabric here, even if it doesn't allow any light in, because there's a gap here, you're going to get light that comes right in between those two gaps. So it's never completely room darkening unless you were to do another layer behind it or a curtain or drapery over the top. But this is the overall look of the hybrid shade known as all those other things. And I just wanted to show it to you so that if we're ever talking about it, like in your home, I want to be able to show you exactly how it works and give you some of the details. Uh, also, because we are in late 2022, they are coming up with mandates as far as the uh, cords that might hang down, whether it be continuous cord loop, 
They do make these in cordless, so you can just grab the bottom and lift it, uh, obviously motorized, and then they have a lot of different options that if cords are eliminated, which are traditional on these, a clutch where it wraps, if you, um, if the mandates come down within the next few months, then just know that these shades can still be available that way. I just wanted to provide a lot of information on this product, and I thank you very much for watching the Kempler Design Blog.